good morning guys today is gonna be a day in my life i have a few appointments today i'm getting my nails done i like soaked them off last night and so i just wanted to bring you guys with me and show you guys what i'm up to today and if you like videos like this then give me a big thumbs up oh my gosh this hair it's like looks like i have a bang i don't know what is going on but um, for breakfast today, I was thinking that I'm just gonna like keep it simple. video to properly introduce Theo because I kind of like did it <laughs> I got him I want to say in February actually but I didn't say anything because I wanted to make sure that they got along and I wanted to make sure that Paris was going to like accept him I'm also going to insert some footage and I want to just kind of show you guys like the whole experience <laughs> That's you. Look. That's you. See? That's you. It's a mirror. You still purring? You still purring now? You are so sweet. Whoa, crazy mode activated. Come on. Come here. Can you come here? He's a Scottish fold and he is a lilac point because he's got all his paws and his ears and his face that are like dark. Oh, he's so sweet. You are so freaking cute. He's so cute. Look how cute he is. And he just lets me do whatever because he's just so cute. And he's just so small. And he just is so, like, chill. I've been basically keeping him in this room to kind of quarantine him. And I am going to introduce them hopefully in a few days. But I want to do it right because I was reading up on it and apparently like the cats can resent each other for life if you don't do things properly. <gasps> don't fall! Don't fall, baby! <laughs> I just love his little paws. I love how he's gray. What are you doing? You just being cute over there? I feel like they're trying to like communicate so i feel like that could be a good sign but i don't know i just feel like it's too soon for them to meet i don't want them to freak out but maybe i'll remove the covering today <laughs> and kind of see how they do i don't know and i'm also feeding them on opposite sides so that they can associate it with positive things and i'm gonna just move this a little bit so they can see each other eat. And that's a good sign that he's still eating. Food is like happy vibes. And when you feed them next to each other, then they kind of associate each other with like good vibes.
All right, so today is the day where I feel like Paris is ready to meet the new kitty because the new kitty keeps jumping out and they've kind of like already seen each other, which is like not how it's supposed to go. But yeah, we're gonna let Paris in this room for like maybe 10 to 15 minutes and see what happens. And so they say like to play with them so that they have something to do and so they're not fighting. He's like, can we wrestle? They're talking. Yeah. And he just on your foot with the tongue sticking out. I'm done. It's okay. He's got to. That's part of it. But he's scared. Yeah, she's got to let him know. Like I'm the I'm the cat that's here. All right, we're gonna take Paris out. I mean, I think this was a good ten minutes. We're starting off slow because Paris is like kind of anxious. I am dead right now. How are you? He got <laughs> hold. <laughs> hold on. <laughs> He's like, I got my prey. Don't ask about my hair right now. I am currently refreshing just like my edges and then yeah, just ignore that. But I have been letting Kitty out just kind of like a little bit each day for a couple hours and today has been a breakthrough. I wanna show you guys. Hi babies. I just thought this was the cutest thing ever. I came down and they're just like sleeping together and being cute. I was kind of nervous that they weren't going to get along, but it looks like they're starting to. Guess what I got? Workout clothes. Yay. I'm just getting my workout clothes on because I am going to try to work out today. I haven't worked out in like... <laughs> a while. I got this from VS. I'm gonna do like a quick little workout outside and hopefully I don't mess up my hair. Last time I worked out, I literally got sick. So, fingers crossed. girl is officially out of shape I was doing so good like a few months ago but you really have to be consistent I'm so glad I looked at the time because I have an appointment at 1 45 and for my nails and I literally have like maybe 15 minutes to get ready Reflexes are like hella quick. So, the great thing about like having your hair done is that you don't really need to wear makeup because then it's like, you know, my hair is done, I'm looking cute, and plus, I'm wearing a mask, so I don't really care. But yeah, I am going to be late. What's new? Just pulled up to the nail salon, and so I'm just like feeling super good. I feel like my hair is just looking like on point today.
car just got my nails done it took quite a second because they didn't really have like a lot of options and I had to pick out like each color and so let me just show you my nails I also got my toes done and so these are the final nails kind of like a brownish nudish ombre something different I saw like a picture on Instagram and I just really wanted to try it this is a horrible angle but I'm about to head off to my next appointment I'm actually getting a lash lift my lashes grow straight down like straight out and so I mean these are kind of lifted a little bit but I don't know what's going on with my lashes they are not like up and cute so I'm gonna get a lash lift it's just gonna help lift my eyelashes and just kind of separate them and make them look better like with mascara and stuff because lately I haven't been wearing like a lot of makeup First thing you gotta do when you get in the car. <sighs> I am so excited and happy that I got my lashes done. Do you guys see the difference? Now my lashes are actually like visible and especially when I put on mascara. Highly recommend lash lifts. I love getting them. If you're somebody that when they curl their eyelashes, literally the curler does nothing and the lashes just stay straight down, which is literally me, then I would highly recommend getting a lash lift. And this is like such a weird angle, oh my gosh, but you can just see like how lifted everything is. 24 hours hot shower, 48 hours makeup, like mascara, and you know, other than that, I'm good. But let's go home. I wanna go home. You have no idea how good it feels to be home. Got their bowls. This is how I open it because, you know, long nail props. But they go crazy for this food. How are you, Bubba? Everybody has like their annoying like animal voice. That's mine. No, for real though. Like at this point, I feel like he thinks his name is Bubba. Like he doesn't respond to Paris anymore. I know. Here you go, baby. Come on, Bubba. Your food's on this side. Um, what am I gonna eat? Tell me what you see in me. Honestly, I am just way too tired to cook something right now. It's already eight, so we decided on just getting some Postmates. It's this place called Bossa Nova. We're gonna go pick it up and... Change real quick, I finally got my food. I get the penne pasta. So realized that I didn't go through any of my emails today so I'm just gonna do that and yeah there's a few things that I needed to send over a few concepts all right so now onto the challenge of washing my face without getting my lashes wet because i can't get them wet for like 48 hours so fingers crossed because i did that before i like jumped in the shower like after a day and i completely ruined my lash lift so not doing that just have to be really careful Just applying my retin a kind of like on my problem areas like not all over my face but just on certain spots and then put my lotion on i usually put lotion like around my eyes but i feel like it's water-based so i probably can't maybe i could do like here i got a little friend right here so i'm gonna use my pimple patches and just put it right on top and like stick it on pretty good just like that and you leave it on overnight and it literally just like sucks everything out
And so I finished washing my face. I am ready to go to sleep. So this is where I'm gonna end today's vlog. I hope that you guys liked this video. And if you did, please make sure to give me a big thumbs up. Maybe I'll do more. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video.